Hi, our expectation from the budget are that it will provide for growth mainly on the infrastructure sector. Like CARE has now come out recently with a new guidelines for rating of infrastructure companies. This will help us differentiate the infrastructure companies which have strong cash flows and strong concessions as against other companies where the volatility is higher. So our expectations in this budget is that the budget will provide for the separate credit rating for these infrastructure companies as has been developed by us and other rating agencies. And it will also allow specified classes of investors, mainly the long-term investors, to invest in the same. So rather than the normal uh, ratings we use for Basel II and capital markets, we use infrastructure rating for such investors. Then we are also looking at long-term visibility for various fiscal incentives for renewable energy. So right now these uh, incentives are available for, for a year or two and this disrupts the planning. So we are looking at a long-term incentives for renewable energy such as accelerated depreciation, central subsidy, generation-based incentives, incentive for transmission networks, etc. to enable uh, the investors and uh, other financiers to plan on a long-term basis. We are also expecting that there would be new incentive for debt-based AIFs to enable them deep in the capital market. AIFs are going to play an important role in the Indian capital market, for they will do something which is different from the market. And hence, the budget should provide more incentives to such AIFs and allow them to take over non-prime loans. This will help deepen the capital market and also take the burden of the banking sector. Thank you.